hello guys in this video I will show you how to create a CHM file so the first question comes into mind is what is a CHM file so uh, the file you are seeing on your screen is a CHM file and it's a collection of HTML file which are compiled together and these CHM file are generally used as a help for different software or uh, some of the books are also published as a CHM file online so CHM file you can use to create a help uh, text of uh, your software or you can create a book online or which you can publish online so um, generally if you uh, search or uh, for CHM in your search uh, box so I will write CHM you can f find at least one or two CHM file in your uh, system if you have some softwares so for example I have this user manual I open it and it's for Oracle virtual box so it's a uh, user user manual for this software so you can create a user manual help provider or books with this uh, so software or with this CHM file. So uh, let's get started and I will show you how to uh, create a CHM file and how you can find CHM file. Generally if you have uh, Windows and if you have uh, this uh, Visual Studio installed in your system you will find when you go to the search option and here you write help or HTML help workshop so generally you can find uh, this uh, software on your system by default and if not we can find it on online just go to your browser and just write HTML help workshop okay and this HTML help workshop is a Microsoft uh, software so just go there first link and you can just download this uh, HTML workshop from here just click download and just click the first option and click next and you will download this exe file and this file you can install very easily on your system so once if you uh, you have installed this uh, html help work work uh, shop on your system then i will open it html workshop and it will open like this here so what you can do is you can create a new project we are going to uh, see how we can create a simple CHM file so I will go to help new and I will select project and click OK and I will click next and here I will give uh, the title of my CHM file so for example I will write my CHM file as user manual and I will select the folder in which I want to uh, save this CHM file so for example I have already folder made so I will give the path of that folder and press enter and I will click OK open But first of all, we will give the name of this uh, file. So I'll write user manual once again and click open and click next. And if you have already uh, made your HTML file, because CHM file is a collection of HTML files, so if you have already uh, made HTML help files, then you can just 
select it and then just add it from here so you can add your previously made HTML file but I don't have previously made HTML right now so I will just leave these blank and click next and click finish so now I have uh, this pro project made and then I will make some HTML files for example so I will go to file new and now I will make a HTML file for my table and let's see what can be the title let's look here in our HTML file so let's say we want to give the name of the first HTML file as about okay and click OK so this is the HTML file make and here you can give the HTML code so that you can have your HTML file for example I will provide a paragraph here and I will say my first chm file and then I will save this file so I will go to file once again and save file as and I will say because it's my about file so I will name it as about and save it in the same folder and in the same way I can make some new file new HTML file once again this file I want to name it as content for example ok and once again I can give any HTML code here so let's see what HTML code we can give here so we, we are going to give a paragraph here and let's say this is a content file okay and you can provide a list of content file you just need to know little basics of HTML this file also I will save as and this is my content file okay so right now I have two file two HTML file made then what I will do is I will go to here project and I will click this button and here I can give a title to my project and I can choose the default file so default file is the first file uh, which it will open okay so for now I will close this and let's create a content of this chm file first so I will click on content tab and I will say create a new content file ok and here I will say this is my about content file ok so because the first HTML file we made is for the about so content we can give the topic as about and it has extension .hsc and I will save it and now my content is made now I will go here insert a page I will click this button so when I hover over here I will click this button and I will say once again about and add a file here and I can add any file from here so I will browse for my about file is it here or not ok browse about and click ok and click ok so this is my about content 
in the same way I will add a second page which is my content page right I will click it once again and I will say content and I will add a new file which is my content file this HTML file I have made also and click OK and click OK so I have two files one is about and one is content you can adjust this file you can move up any file you can move down or wherever you want and you can also create an index so when you click this index tab and it will show a dialog box and you will click OK and index I will leave this index default and I will save it and now my index is also made so once you are done with your content and index you can add some more files and uh, help decks whatever you want once you are done with that you go to file and you save all the files before compiling it and once again you go to file and click compile from here also or you can click this button also and now you can browse the folder in which you want to create this file so I will choose the same file in which I have created the other files so I will click open and I will give the name of my file so that was user manual for example YouTube and I will open it and you can select this save all file before compiling so it's good that it will save all the file before compiling and I will click compile okay it has given me error because I think I have selected a wrong file so just select this .hhp file from here and click open and now we compile it and it's compiled okay and now when you compile your file you can just go to the folder where you have compiled your file and you can see here a chm file is made for you you can see here and when you open it it will look like a chm file and in which you have this about page and you have this com content you have the index also so we if you have so many uh, HTML file and a big content then you can search for your content also from here so in this way you can uh, create a CHM file this was the only the first step and you can um, add your idea of creating a CHM file and use it in your project somewhere so I hope you have enjoyed this video please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now